His name is Green Light to Heaven, and the sky is the limit for this individual. I heard Warren Kennedy coming back, and he said he looks very, very talented. Now, when I try to compare the favorite and him, the times obviously look to be wrong. Um, yeah, Sheldon, you know, that's, that's it also is something that I, I looked at, you know, and, um, you know, the, the favorite trialed on the same day, you know, one trial apart, and did 46, uh, I think it was 46.20 or 46.40 or something, and we did 47.57 or something. So there was a second and a half, um, you know, which represents probably about, in real terms, probably about three lengths, you know, over that distance, you know, maybe two lengths. So it always made it interesting, you know, and um, you know, obviously that uh, the stable um, backed the favorite, you know, they fancy the horse. And I respect this field. I think there were some decent horses here. You know, the second and third horse on, on slouches. And um, this was, um, I think he's going to go the trip. You know, he's not just going to be a sprinter. He's got a beautiful uh, pedigree to stay the, stay the trip. But it was impressive the way he won, you know. And, um, you know, one never knows actually the strength of your opposition in these juvenile races. You know, we get an indication. You know, not like we were in the dark. Miles Barrier trialed very well. You know, you know, 40, 40, I think 47 and a half seconds on the bridle is a, is a decent trial. Um, but just the fact that the, some of the others who did a better time puts you a little bit in, in question. And also the fact that Miles looks like he wants ground. You know, he's not a sprinter at all. You know, he's, he's a horse that'll go the trip. He's bred to go the trip. So I think there's a bit of quality about him. And our owner, Dashen uh, Naike, who, who won with Living Waters the other day, and and now he's one with give me the uh, uh, green light to heaven. He's a he's a converted Christian, and um, he's named his horses um, in the Christian line, which is wonderful. I think that's very really admirable of Dashen. He's converted to Christianity, and he's named his horses in some Christian, uh, you know, like green light to heaven, living waters. Wonderful names, and a, a better man you won't get uh, in terms of a new owner in the game. And um, we wish him all the success in the future and uh, thank him for his support. He's got a lot of horses on our stable and um, he's going to have a lot more success. He's, you know, he's got some smart horses and this horse I think is going to go a long way. Just before you leave us, a horse like Oratorina at a big price, can she sneak in? Yeah, she's dropped in the ratings and um, third run after the rest and working well. So I think she could sneak in there somewhere. There we go from Bloodstock, South Africa. For the winning trainer, a little bit extra. Thank you. Nice initiative. Well done. Thank you. Warren Kennedy, hot, hot, hot like the weather. Congratulations. Thanks very much, Sheldon. The favourites seem to try and match you, but you broke their spirit coming to the 200. Yeah, look, um, always my plan. You know, I watched the barrier trials, both of them very, very closely, and this horse, uh, the favourite had a good speed, but nothing was challenging him really so i wanted to see what he'd do under pressure and i'm also got speed and i put him under pressure pretty much from the start you know i got about half length ahead of him and i had to make him work to get to me my also actually got there and he was going so comfortably sheldon i was i was actually surprised i thought she's i'm going so well yeah it's going to take a very good one to come past him and with all due respect when i pressed the button he turned it on tremendously and i think the shin no it's early but i think he's got something good yeah so um takes a, a horse that's going to stay a good horse to win sprints like this you know they've got to have some sort of toe about them and he's got it he switched off so beautifully in front effortless Sheldon and when I asked him to run quick and well he was here he came back here could hardly blow out a candle so that's a great signs going forward well done to Gavin and a special well done to Deshaun you know he's invested in stable he's a lovely man and he deserves all the success you're riding just about every day doing all the traveling Who's your next best? Obviously, you would have had a glance and had a look through, but obviously with all the traveling and the riding, it's difficult to try and pinpoint and assess all the form lines. Yeah, look, I look at the race card the night before races because the next day I'm at a different course. <laughs> so, Sheldon, I had a, a quick breeze through last night and a bit this morning, and I thought maybe Mai Tai. Look, I've got respect for Mr. Puller's horse that at one is made last time, but one effortlessly. You know, it's, it looks like a decent filly, so I've got big respect for that horse, but I'd probably lean towards Mai Tai, pause of victory, and... Uh, like you, you've been pointed out this morning on your show, I watched uh, Oratorina third run back off the rest. I've jumped on. It should be a peak run. So let's hope she can bring it home for the boys. I like that smile. Well done. Thanks very much, Sheldon. And well done to winning form again. Let's get the winning owner coming through, and he'll get a nice added bonus from Bloodstock South Africa. Congratulations. This looks decent. Yes, it does. We're quite impressed with it. We're happy with it. You know, thanks to Gavin for all the work he does back home with us, and also top right from Warren. 
and all the boys back at home at the Gavin Stables. So yeah, I think we're going to have a bit of fun this year. Well, there's more fun. 60,000 Rand added on there. So well done, Bloodstock South Africa. Extra 60,000 Rand there. Daniel Rennie from Hollywood Bets is going to step in. Blue three. Mzeloa Jawala. There we go, the winning groom, his 1,000 Rand token, courtesy of Hollywood Bets and Gold Circle. And away uh, they go. Kudalut uh, right down the inside. Kufalut was one of the first to get going, but his market rival, Green Light to Heaven, is right up sides of Kufalut. Those two clear of Vaz Illusion. Sir Palm showing some pace, but a couple of lengths off the early leaders with Bold Surrey. Hard wide is quite some way back in the early stages. Got six lengths to make up as they come down towards the 600. And green light to heaven has taken over the lead by half a length. Coup for loot has been driven to the inside. Anton Marcus switches Vaz Illusion to the outside of those two. These three are well clear. 300 metres left to race. Green light to heaven has the edge. Coup for loot down the inside. Vaz Illusion in third. The rest are quite far back, but Walls of Dubrovnik is starting to run on quite nicely. Green light to heaven, though, is stamping his authority. And green light to heaven wins with his rider looking over the shoulder. The second place will go to Walls of Dubrovnik or Sir Palm. Very close between those to Vaz Illusion back in fourth and Coup for Loot faded away tamely. Green light to heaven. Warren Kennedy races clear after being up with the pace from the start. Shook off his rivals going into the final 200 and it was a race over in a matter of strides. Warren Kennedy had the luxury of looking over his shoulder and just driving him out with the hands. It's going to be close for second on that Sir Pom might just get second, ahead of a very good run from Walls of Dubrovnik in third. Vaz Illusion, no extra in the later stages, finishes fourth. And Coup for Loot, rather disappointing, back in fifth position. Here's the head-on. Green light to heaven gets shaken up as they come inside the final 200. A couple of reminders, but very quickly, he absolutely draws clear to win it comfortably. So that's the result of the first race here at Hollywood Bet Scottsville. Victory for Warren Kennedy, the fun sales and green light to heaven as we greet you for the time being and head you back to the Teletrack studio in Rivonia.